It was like one of those things where I was nervous. You know, I was like, do they realize they left part of me in the landing? Do they realize they left the other half of me over there? Cause I only feel half of me right now. So I must have been, I must have been feeling the hurt half, but I was so loopy that I didn't think it hurt. I was just like, I can only feel half of me. Where's the other half? <laughs> Yeah, it's about as good as it gets. If you have to stare out of a hospital room, you should probably stare out a window like this. Yeah, that one looks pretty good. Yeah, it's, uh, it's not bad, that's for sure. My doctor sister has seen me through the hard times and uh, we're already starting to see the good times. So she's gonna roll on home back to Vegas where she does her job as a surgeon. And I'm gonna hang out here until they can fly me home. Mm -hmm. Thanks for all your help, sir. Oh, it'll be just fine. It's okay. just a broken bone. No worries. Yeah. Hi, buddy. I had so much fun skiing with you. It is so good. Okay. Um. Can I kiss? You don't want to give me kiss. Oh, thanks, buddy. Bye. Do you have friends? New friends. Oh, hello. This is not the food that they serve you in the uh, in the hospital. But if you got friends, you can get some. I'm pretty excited about that. For the first time in my life, potentially, I'm I'm finishing this burger before it's all the way gone. It was a giant burger, but you know that's just not me. So pray for me, because uh, yeah, sad moment. I'm full. I've never seen David White not finish a meal. This is, no, this is the first. I think tomorrow will be more of a normal day where we can like go do something, but like yesterday we were here all day, today we were kind of here all day because then we were napping after that, so. Um, tomorrow hopefully we can like actually do an activity here. Like run some energy out. If the swelling in my leg goes down in the next couple days, then they're gonna expatriate me, as they say, here in uh, Austria and send me back home to the U.S. So I'm pretty, I'm looking forward to that. I do love it here; it's beautiful, but I want to go home. What day is it? I don't know, I think it's day two or day three after the accident. What do you think about all this stuff? Uh, it's a new adventure. We didn't have enough, so we're just piling adventures over adventures. This one is pretty fun. Though. We're stuck here. And we're waiting for David to be sent back home. I don't know what to feel like. I mean, I'm not hurt. I can still walk. I went to the park with the kids. We jumped on the trampoline. Tomorrow we're taking Daddy and he's gonna be watching us for the first time. Do we have shoes or? No. Okay, so. It's okay. Some crutches operated. Crutches in front operated between. Thank you. Bye. Past 
passed my first walking test. <laughs> Ow! It's like I got my leg flayed open and a bunch of hardware put in there or something. It really doesn't want to move very much. <laughs> but at least I can move. That's kind of a relief. It's not my first time out of doors, but it's my first long outing since my surgery a couple days ago. Taking the kids to the park. Luckily, there's a park here, right, in striking distance from the hospital with some cool stuff. So, with the trampoline! There's a trampoline. I figure I might as well just do some backies with just one leg. Because, you know, I got one still. How many dates have you guys been on while David has been injured? How many dates? Yeah. <laughs> One. Oh, like. Like while, like in yeah, our Yeah, that's life. true. Well, most of our relationship is based around me being injured, actually. Because uh, when we first got together, it was because I blew my knee. Yeah. And I couldn't run away from her anymore, so she <laughs> snatched me up. He was like, oh, you have a lot of uh, time where you're incapacitated. Why don't we hang out a bunch then? And then we got married shortly thereafter. <laughs> yeah, that's the way I look at it. Yeah. <laughs> so, I guess we'll have to just get married again. <laughs> Uh, he told me yesterday that the earliest possible date would be the coming weekend. Okay. okay but the point is, right now we have 7.9 gram percent. Yeah. And we cannot expect that the hemoglobin count will be 10 or a little bit above 10 on the weekend. Okay. So, with other words, it could be that uh, the, the, uh, your flight back is not. You cannot expect that it will take place on the weekend. Okay. Maybe sometimes in the next week or so.